I'm Kate, my husband and I, Matthew, decided that we wanted to, to buy a pub in the countryside, um, somewhere in this area, and found the Clifton Arms, which was the perfect spot for us. Our aim in terms of food is to provide good food with good service. Um, we're not aiming for fine dining, we're aiming for good village pub food. Matthew has lots of experience in fine dining restaurants. Um, he's worked in both one and two Michelin style restaurants, um, locally and, and also further afield. The Clifton Arms has a, a good range of, of facilities. We've got space for eating, we've got space for drinking, and we will in the future have space for sleeping as well. A lot of the produce is very local. Um, a lot of people within the village bring up their vegetables and their fruit for us to use. We've got a broad range of customers who come to the pub. We have a lot of families who come in. Um, we have a lot of regulars from the village and we also have people who come from further afield. We also do a, a mum's coffee morning for mums and children to come down on a Wednesday morning. And with the play facilities, if it's a nice day, it's great for the children to be outside in the sunshine and, and playing while mums can sit and have a coffee and a chat. Welcome to the, the engine room at the Clifton Arms, doing pub food, classics, um, with a sort of using my background in fine dining really, just to make sure all the flavours come through and that the products itself are well sourced. We chose the Clifton Arms really because uh, of its location and what it has to offer. It's got a great garden, um, good sized restaurant, um, it's in a great spot. We're quite fortunate really in this in our area that we're in. We've got a lot of local customers that are growing their own sort of produce um, that they're bringing in for us actually to use in the pubs. So we've got um, Brian's brought in some lovely courgettes which I've used on the menu today and then we've got Sally's brought in some, all of these red currants for us to make into a, a red currant jelly. Um, it's just really nice that all the local customers have um, you know, embraced us, embraced our arrival and um, offering all this great produce for us to use in the restaurant. It's really inspiring for me as a chef and inspiring for the customers I'm sure to be using their own produce um, on the food that they're eating. <laughs>